G'day guys, Ron here from Osborne Digital Marketing. Today we're going to install a LinkedIn Insight Tag or a LinkedIn Pixel. Alright, so ultimately you'll need to be on your LinkedIn profile. You just click the top up here, advertise as long as my noggin's not in the way, advertise. Now that'll take you to your campaign manager. If you haven't ever set up a campaign in LinkedIn, if you don't have anything in the past, a dummy paused, you will need to set something up to be able to activate the actual uh, pixel because that is tied to each campaign that you're running. So you click on the campaign and essentially you'll be brought into uh, the profile here. Now you can click on account assets, conversion tracking, and then what you do from there is the manage insight tag. Okay, you click that C tag. Now, if you, uh, after this video, you'll be able to do this yourself, but if you're not confident and you want to send it to your development team, you can do that. So all you need to do is come here, click the code to copy it to the clipboard, click agree, and then you come to your website. Now, this is a WordPress site. If you have Squarespace, if you have Wix, this can all still be done. Just an important note is that it must be installed in the footer, okay? Where every other code is installed in the head, LinkedIn for some reason decided to be unique and wonderful and go for the footer. So we utilize this plugin, the HFCM. That's a header footer code manager. Brilliant plugin, it's completely free. I've got a video on how to install that on your WordPress site if you want to check that out. So we click on that. And we add a new snippet. We name the snippet. So LinkedIn Pixel. Now we want it to be site wide. Just remember to change that to footer. And we simply paste our code in there and hit the save button. And that's basically it for the website now. Sometimes you will need to clear the cache. Uh, so a cache is essentially just a box of old pieces of your website that gets spat out quicker to other individuals, you might need to clear the cache. So you want to clear the cache and then that way this pixel should be displayed immediately. Now the brilliant thing about tracking pixels, especially with LinkedIn, is let's say someone Googles uh, plumber in Miami. If that individual finds your site and they look at your website and you have this pixel installed, and you're running a LinkedIn campaign, you have to have live ads, then when that individual jumps over to LinkedIn to browse, your ad that you're running in LinkedIn will be redisplayed to them. That's very, very powerful and what you should be doing if you're going to be marketing and, and spending significant sums of money on this type of stuff. Now, the way you do that is you come in, you go matched audiences. Again, you can do a ton of different things here, guys. I'm just gonna keep it simple for you. So we have the code installed on the website. All we need to do is we click here on the create audience. We go website. Now we name, we just give this a name. So maybe a website. How long do we want to re-engage them? So it, sooner, is better than later, depending upon what service product you're selling. Uh, 60 days is, I would say, the maximum that you want to go to. Now, when it comes to here, all you need to do is fill out your website details. So we just simply grab this here. Install that. Agree and create. That's it, guys. So now when the, uh, it will be activated uh, when someone visits your site so if we do visit the site and because we do now have the tracking we might be able to have my site pop up so we might be able to activate it now however it can take 24 hours to become active to be completely honest uh, find that the LinkedIn pixel is not as fast responding as Facebook and Twitter uh, this is it and you will have a bit more uh, there's sometimes more troubleshooting to be done with the LinkedIn campaigns. Don't know why they are working on improving that, but it, it does become a uh, little bit of a challenge sometimes. So ideally, you would just want to keep checking in, make sure that this is changed to uh, active. You do need to have an active campaign uh, to enable that to happen. Still hasn't fired, but ultimately, guys, 
that's it. That's what you've uh, got to do. Very straightforward. Just check in with it uh, tomorrow, a couple of hours time, and it should be green. Just revisit the site, get a partner, friend to visit the site, and that should trigger um, everything. It should be live now. Again, you don't have the ability to check it like you do Facebook or Twitter with the uh, pixel extenders, um, which hopefully LinkedIn will create. If you have any questions, just hit me up in the, in the comment section down below. I'm happy to help out. Uh, if you've gained any value from this video, please hit that like button. Always helps and it's, it's lovely to see that people support the channel. So thank you for that. Hope you guys have a lovely day. Cheers.